Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the Call of the Wild experience. Today we got part four for you guys. If you guys haven't seen parts one to three just yet, go check them out. The links will be down in the description for those three. This series has been an absolute blast and I hope you guys enjoy it. Today we're gonna take our first steps ever into Hirschfelden. We're gonna hunt some animals. We're gonna go and see if we can find some fallow deer. We gotta unlock the Hyperion scope. We're getting very close. And I really hope that you guys enjoy this video. If you do, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're on the road to 50,000 subscribers, but with Without further ado, let's just jump into the video. All right, guys, here we go. Hirschfelden. I have not touched Hirschfelden on the beginner series yet, so here we go. Let's go. First time getting into Hirschfelden. We're going to unlock uh, the first outpost, the first lookout. We'll do the first couple missions just like we did in Layton. And then I want to get out. I want to see if we can find some fallow deer. Hi, um, I heard here you we go. finally arrived. Welcome to Central Europe. Yeah, baby. Let's go. I'm Connie, the Wildheater of Hirschfelden. Reserve Warden, that is. I'm here to make sure that your time here will be unforgettable. Hirschfelden is one of the oldest hunting reserves in Europe, and we host a diverse population of the most popular big game for all hunting tastes. It's also the most beautiful place on Earth. No, I'm not biased at all. I remember the first time I ever played Call of the Wild. Go uh, ahead and have a look around. I can't wait for you to experience all the beauty of Hirschfelden's fields and forests. Cool. Why don't you see if you can find an animal track nearby? Okay, we're gonna do that, Connie. We're gonna do that. Uh, I started with Hirschfelden. When I first started playing this game, I started with Hirschfelden. And I remember some things about that, uh, but I'm just really excited to kind of do that all over again because that was almost six years ago. Okay, we gotta locate a track, shoot an animal, and harvest the animal. Right, this is where we start. Okay, so eventually, what's this? So eventually she's gonna want us to go up to this lookout point, and then I imagine there's gonna be there's gonna be an outpost post around here somewhere too that we can uh, unlock. Okay, so we gotta find an animal. Oh gosh, so what level are we just to kind of get caught back up here? Level six, we've had a couple skill points, a couple perk points. Uh, we're trying to unlock the Hyperion scope and we're gonna need 12,000 to buy it. So we're gonna have to do a little bit of hunting, do some missions, get some money, a little bit more rifle score, we'll have it unlocked. Should be able to unlock that in this video. That's the goal, to get that Hyperion. Okay, I think I'm gonna come to the conclusion that this is gonna be like impossible in the dark. So what I might do, hang on, let's let's give it one little, it's somewhere over here, but I can't see nothing. Let's try turning the flashlight off. Okay, I can see a little bit better with that off. What we might have to do is just go up and get that lookout point and then get the first outpost, make it daytime and then get this uh, mission done. I'm thinking that's what I'm gonna do. It's not very far. Just run up north here, grab this lookout point. Uh, that's, I think that's the outpost right there. And then we'll be able to make it daytime, get this mission done. Go from there, baby. Ooh, road ear call, female road ear. All right, first lookout point in Hirschfelden, about to be unlocked. Let's go. All right, here we go. Hirschfelden. The land of opportunity. A for a lot of hunters. The fallow deer is such a classic animal to hunt. But we also get a lot of history buffs here. To the south lies the Hirschdorf Hügelgrab, a grave mound dating back to Hirschdorf the Bronze Age. Hügelgrab. Sweet. Thanks for the info, Connie. I really do appreciate that. All right, let's get up here, 400 meters away. Just a little less than half a kilometer. We're going to unlock the cell post, make it daytime so we can see some things and stuffs. So we can see the things and stuffs. And then we're going to down an animal, get that mission done, get out there. See if we can hunt a little bit of fallow deer, man. If we can find a fallow deer trophy, that'd be pretty cool. But the ultimate challenge, the main thing that we're focusing on today, the ultimate uh, task is to get that friggin' Hyperion scope. Get rid of that Ascent scope. Get that thing out of here. We, we need the Hyperion. And then we're going to be good to go. We can start saving up for the 7 mil, which is a $36,000 purchase. Once we got that, we can go out. We can go back to late and start hunting some rosies, maybe some moose. We can hunt some bigger animals in Hirschfelden here. And eventually, I think the first DLC that we're going to buy, I haven't fully decided this yet. I think we're going to get Verhaga Savannah for our third map. We might skip Medved, go straight to Verhaga, and then maybe do Medved after that. But uh, yeah, really excited to do some beginner stuff on Verhaga. I think that's going to be super, super cool. Let's grab this thing. Let's just get this thing out of the way. We might as well. We might as well. We might as well. Can I just please just... Oh my... It's just... Okay, all right. 
Sweet. Lore. I like lore. All right. We made it, baby. Looks like we made it. There's a shed in there. Oh, it's a fallow shed. Let's get this. Hunter XP. All right, let's go grab that shed. There's a shed in here. Let's go. Oh, wait, what? Oh, hang on. It's either under the floorboards or it's right there. Ow. Nice. Oh, you found a shed. Yeah. I remember finding a big deer antler for the first time as a kid. It felt like I had dug up some real treasure. I still yeah. have it at home. That's awesome, Connie. That's awesome. Let's make it, uh, I don't know. Fowler deer drink it like what, 10? Yeah, I think they do. I think they do drink it 10. the time when not hunting, many of the animals are shedding their antlers this time of year. They're still tricky to find, of course, but I guess that's why people like to collect them. Okay, so now we can go out, we can do this, uh, this mission, right? What do we got? Um, mission log, track down and harvest your first animal. So all we gotta do is just find the animal and shoot it. Shouldn't be too hard to do that. Now, fallow deer, throw, getting ahead of myself just a little bit here. For the fallow deer hunt, the fallow deer on the right side of the map, they're basically, like, you could draw a line kind of like right here. So all these little lakes, we can start venturing out to all these little lakes. They're all along the river. I don't know, it can be pretty tedious to run the river. Um, but I might start, like, tracking out to these lakes. We should be able to, see, we should see lots of fallow deer at these lakes. We might be able to find something really cool. But first things first, let's just find one, right? Shoot it, get that mission done, get the XP, get a little bit of money. Let's see how far we are from this Hyperion. I don't think we're very far. I think it's only like 900 rifle score. And the main thing right now is the money though, because I'm down to 1500 after that time reset. Um, so let's see, rifle sights, Hyperion, Hyper Hi 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 Hyper Hyperion. There it is, 12,000. So the rifle score, we're gonna hit that before we get to the amount of money that we need. So the rifle score is a non-issue. We're about to hit it, we're 90 points away. So we really just gotta get that money and then it's unlocked. And then we don't have to use that ascent scope anymore. That that horrible ascent scope. Uh, so let's get out, let's do it, man. Let's make it happen. Ooh, five medium red fox. Red fox would actually not be I got too another male to, to my right, look at this. Small size, making them difficult to spot. They do scare quite easily though. Oh. There's a female there too. Just surrounded by red fox at the moment. That's a common, right? Yeah. Just lighter in color. Not piebald. I wouldn't mind getting one of these down. Um, I got the 243. Let's see. I'm gonna try. Oh man, I I flicked it to the left just a little bit. Before I shot, I shouldn't have done that. And they're gone. All good. All good. Not the easiest animals to hit. Ooh, pheasants. Hirschfeld and pheasants. Hirsch pheasants. Bro, this is my first time seeing the pheasants on Hirsch uh, since they were added to the map. Hmm. Awesome. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We got fallow drinking. Nice. Nice. Is it just I notice you're after a dome? fallow deer. Be sure to stay concealed. They have some of the best eyesight among the reserve animals. Their good hearing and smell doesn't make things easier either. Sheesh. I think that might even be just a doe by herself over there. That I mean, it's enough for the mission, but it's enough for the mission. But it'd be nice to see some males. I hear more fallow deer around. I don't know where, but keep hearing them making noise so she's by herself which it looks like she is we will take her down for the mission with the 270 oh maybe not maybe not there's another doe here we go <laughs> they're just spread out okay we got a few males there look at this maybe we can get a couple of them look at this Bunch of males. I don't see anything massive. I don't see any monsters in there. But this will do the trick. That guy looks nice. He's a level four. So those two right there would be perfect. Let's see what we can do. I wonder if I can get both. Hang on. Let's get a little closer. Definitely want that four. That three would be a nice bonus if we get both. 
So I'm going to keep the spot on that three. If I can. It's not going to let me spot it because I'm getting too close. There we go. Alright. Right here. Too quick. Too quick. But, let's see. Oh no, too much wobble. Alright, here we go. First fallow deer down. Let's go. 152.5. Three very easy little silver there. Got through the lung. Very nice. Let's go, you guys. 957 cash. Not bad. And uh, that's going to work for our mission. XP 177. Let's check out the mission log. Visit a lookout point. Well, I already did that, but I guess I did it out bearings, of order. There are lookout points spread out all over the reserve. Well, I already did that, though, Connie. I guess I did it out of order. Fair enough. So now I got to run. <laughs> I got to run all the way to another lookout. Let's just go up to this one. Ow, what the heck, man? I'm just trying to get to the lookout point. What the heck was that, dude? Oh my gosh, another one. I'm getting attacked. Friggin' road ears. All right, here we go. We made it. We made it. Lookout point number two. Needed to do it for the mission. All good. Here we go. Let's Quite get that XP. View, get that it? money. From here, you can see a lot oh, it's of beautiful, great Connie. It's beautiful. In the nearby area. Under XP. There we go. Cash? Should we get a little cash for that? We might not. Yes, we do. We get a thousand cash. Wow. Worth it, dude. Now she wants me to get a lookout. Wait, hang on. Now Be she sure probably wants me... The yeah. <laughs> oh, They're essentially base camps. So, there you go. You gotta do them in order. If you don't do them in order, right? You gotta kill the animal first, then you gotta get the lookout point, then you gotta get the outpost. I went the other way around, and uh, you gotta do them in order. So now we gotta get another outpost? I can't remember which ones are outposts, you guys. I'm such a noob. That might be an outpost there. Oh, it's right up there. Okay, there we go. That's the outpost. So I'm just gonna drive up there. I'll take the ATV. We'll make it quick. And that's gonna be some more XP and some more cash. So it's definitely worth it to do that. And then after we get that, we're gonna go out and find some more fallow deer and see what we can find. Take some fallow deer down. Get that Hyperion scope unlocked. It's gonna be epic. Let's go. All right, outpost number two. We made it, baby. Oh, apologize for that. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Look up point number two already. So we got two outposts already. Cozy, we got. Right? Outposts are great for stocking up or wow, just taking a break. Interrupted me. Two outposts unlocked, two lookout points unlocked already. Another thousand cash there. Beautiful. We're back up to 5.5k. So now that that's done, guys, we're going to get out. We're going to hunt some fallow. I'm going to visit some more of these lakes and we'll see what we can find. I might look at the river a little bit and it's going to be awesome. Oh, and I think we did we level up. We leveled up. Let's go level seven and we got a perk point. So let's go in there. Let's jump in. What do we want? How are we going to do it? So, so far we've gotten two rifle perks, okay? So we've gotten muscle memory level one, and we've gotten steady Hi hands I've as got well. I've got a bit of an Connie. unusual question. Gotta stop interrupting me. Mind. Okay, go for, what is it? I think I mentioned Gerlinda, right? No. Well, here's the thing. She's writing a book about fallow deer. Her oh. second one, actually. She's got a small obsession for fallow deer. Mm-hmm. Anyhow, she's a big obsession, perhaps? some pictures for her book and was looking for someone to help out. Okay. It's a bit specific. Okay. I remember hearing that you're quite the photographer yourself, so I thought I'd pass along her offer. <laughs> I don't know. I told you that. A of a fallow deer <laughs> taken in Rottenfeld. She'll pay quite well for it, so it may be worth the effort. Okay. Okay. I mean, I did once take 240 photos of... The same albino moose, so I'm definitely qualified for the job. Uh, where were we though? What were we looking at? Perks? Uh, so yeah, I don't know what I want here. Unlocks the ability to reload all weapons while running. That's kind of nice. That does come in handy. I mean, we don't really need it yet, but decrease edge blur while using shotguns. Okay, okay, so that's only for shotguns. And then bows, we're not really getting into bows just yet. So I feel like, oh, we got zeroing unlocked. Oh, we got to get zeroing. Okay, what's this? Hang on, breath control. Let's unlock zeroing. I think we definitely gotta unlock zeroing. Okay, so we unlock the short range zero. Awesome. And we activate it, and we're good to go. Okay, now we got zeroing. Beautiful. So I can zero for 75 and 150 now. Short range zeroing. Same thing on the 243. Let's go. All right, let's get out and hunt some fallow, you guys. I'm gonna reset the time. I'm gonna set it for like 10.30, and we will get out there, and we'll hunt some fallow, baby. 
Got a mating call from a fallow. Just at the river. Just kind of getting started here from the outpost. Came down to the river. I got a mating call, so they're probably coming in right here. Somewhere here on the beach. Uh, and I should have a drink zone somewhere here. Now we got a little bit of work to do because we got to get up to 12,000. We're at 4.9k oh, right now. So we need about 7,000 cash if we're going to get that Hyperion today. So we got to be able to hit... You know, hopefully it'd be nice to hit a couple fallow out of each herd that we see. Hopefully this guy's coming oh, right here. Okay, we got a level three. Hopefully he will be joined by some more fallow. I don't know exactly where he's headed, but I imagine there's probably going to be a zone on the beach here. There's the zone. Okay, so currently he's by himself. Might just be a solo zone. I might just shoot him. Honestly. I think I might just take him. It's a thousand cash right there. I think I'm just gonna do it. Should do it. Oh, he went straight down. Good shot. Okay. Alright, let's go get him. There's another one. Let's go. Oh, and more of them. Nice. Okay. Now, I wonder if that one's far enough away that I could maybe shoot this four and not spook it. Oh, and there's more of them. Okay. No, no. It looks like maybe a couple more does. I want to shoot that four. It's a little bit out there. But I think I can hit it. Hard shot. Now... Will that spook? Nope, you're still fine. Very nice. Very nice. Now, I've got a dead fallow right in front of me. Pretty close to that four. So let's get a little bit closer, and then we'll drop that three. We are just flying towards that 12k that we need. Make a quick work of it so far. Hopefully we can keep that going. Lots of fallow along the river here, man. you love to see it. Very, very nice. All right, I got a good shot here. Let's see. Oof. Nice. Floating? No. Okay, he's floating, but I got two dead fallow, like, right here. Yeah, one here, one just above. Just above. And then, uh, we'll have our... Alright, we got two dead fallow right here. And then we've got the floater. We'll just wait for him to come in. Let's go. Some good money. Let's see. Nine, so 997, so about 1,000 cash per fallow here. Left lung at heart. Ooh, clutch. Let's go. We'll take it. Another 1,000 cash. Hopefully this guy won't take too long. He's moving in pretty quick. And then we'll see if we got more zones down there. And then this, uh, this level 4 that we took down is right here. Not a bad looking buck. Maybe over a thousand cash for this guy. Might have gone up over a thousand since he's a bigger buck. Let's see. A thousand sixty-eight. Beautiful. That takes us up to just about seven thousand cash. So we're about five thousand away from that Hyperion. About four thousand after we get this guy. So another four or five bucks. And we're gonna be laughing. We're gonna be getting the Hyperion. I gotta back up though. This guy wants to go back here. Alright, here we go. Let's get it. Oh gosh, <laughs> I drowned. A thousand sixty cash for that one. Nice. Beautiful. Let's go. Let's keep it going. See fallow deer. Finally coming back in. It's 1150. Finally got these fallow coming back in. Now, after that time reset, we're at 11,284. So I think a doe would do the trick, just barely. But it'd be better to take down a buck. We get a buck down, we're for sure hitting that 12,000 threshold, and we can for sure get that Hyperion. So let's just wait and see. We've got, this is a zone here, but we've got another one down further. That's where she's going. All right, well, I can't see much, but I got a doe drinking right there. I can see her. Other than that, not a lot going on. I think there's more does in there, but they are hanging out in the bush. Get on up here. Is there a buck in there? I don't think there is, but I think I can hit... Look, I could hit these two right here. Ah, oh, but of course they're going to move. 
They're fidgety. They might be attentive. Take her right now. I'd love to get two of them, though. She's just gonna hang out right there. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, no, there's two of them right here. That could work. That could work. Oof. Well, I definitely got that first one. Don't know if we're getting a second. I think we're just getting the one. Hopefully it uh, pays enough cash to get us up over 12,000. <laughs> Hopefully. It needs to be like, what, 700? 700, 720 would do it. All right, here she is. Moment of truth. Moment of truth. 738. It's enough. Just barely. Uh, apparently, I've shot this one before. <laughs> okay. Somewhere along the way, we shot this doe already. Interesting. All right, cool. That'll do it, though. That's enough cash. Let's go back to the outpost. Let's get the Hyperion. Say goodbye to the Ascent forever. Oh, gosh. I never want to use that thing ever again. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Where is it? Hyperion scope. Where are you? Yes. Finally. Finally. We got the Hyperion. It's done. Beautiful. And now we got 22 cash. So we're at level 7, 8900 XP. Got the Hyperion unlocked. We're making progress, you guys. That's going to conclude this episode. Uh, stay tuned for part 5. I already kind of know what we're going to do. It's going to be really, really cool. Uh, I'll leave it a mystery. I won't uh, let you guys know exactly what that's going to be just yet. But it is going to be a fun one. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you haven't seen parts 1, 2, and 3, the links are down below. Get caught up. Uh, it's going to be an awesome series. I'm super excited for it. I hope you guys are enjoying it. If you are, let me know down in the comments if there's something that you want to see specifically in a future episode episode while we level up and uh, go through this beginner series let me know the called wild experience this is an awesome series and i'm really really enjoying it thank you guys so so much for watching if you enjoyed the video don't forget to drop a like i really appreciate it the likes really do help so i appreciate you guys hitting the like button if you enjoyed the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and as always i will see you guys in the next one